Hello everybody and welcome back to EU4, a Game of Thrones mod. Uh, we did the shat we're picking the, the Shatter World here. And what we're doing right now is we're trying to vassalize a couple guys around us. Uh, we've kind of expanded quite a bit and we've pissed off a few people. So what we might do, once our military is able to get a little bit bigger, is to hit one of these guys. Just to spark the uh, the coalition more maybe but yeah so right now we're trying to vassalize Kenning and Falwell so we're just gonna speed it up here keep my hand on the pause button because just in case I need to suddenly slam it or smack it because someone declares war me look at this one a royal mirror with just has just ended. Eh, mental note. Perfect. They offered it back. Now we're at 177 for these guys down here for Falwell. We're at 136 here. Once they will get to 190, we can offer them. Um, whatever I'm thinking, it's called. Actually, no. Oh, fleet goes there. We're also in the process of building two trade fleets to up our trade power here. Why are you taking so long? 152. You're going down. Nah. Pretty much everyone around us, <laughs> Yarwick joined, um, is joining this. Uh, we're probably going to get our butts kicked soon. Because once they get more powerful than we do, they'll they'll attack. Perfect. Let's see how much more power that gave us. 16, so we're a little over still. Moreland, it's right here. We're still kind of iffy with our our friends. So on the right side, if they declare war on us, at least we'll have a kind of a defense. Because Piper can come in this way. Oh, ooh, Brax. Oh, these guys over here, probably because the last war I was in. Yep. Damn it. And... Looks like we got a bit of a problem here. Aggressive expansion is starting to hurt the ones down here. So this war for uh, for tendering has cost us quite a bit. Hey, we gain a stability. Okay, we're gonna slow down here for a minute. Gain. I don't want you to gain anything. Hmm. Kind of comes down to what do we want to do? We can hire a bunch of mercenaries and attack the coalition and break it. What is it going to do? Stop improving. Switch over to this mode. Pretty much.
much everyone around me hates me. Except for a couple of my allies. What is, do these guys think the same thing? No, the only thing, okay. Oh, it's okay. Um, move alliance. Move roll ties. Okay, so we're going to try and go through just now. No. We're going to see what happens. really don't want that. I'm going to send you to Pike. Try and make me some more money. Whatever, like, is some of these countries can't even keep themselves, you know, properly in power. So, you know, they join the, the coalition, but then they're too busy fighting within themselves to actually, f you know, reach out and reach out and do anything. Okay, so we're going to try and get Jast and Kenning are our two targets for vassalization here. If we can vassalize them, basically we can use this to kind of spend our time to burn off some of this uh, aggressive expansion. Because the aggressive expansion sometimes can come back to really, really bite you in the ass. Thirty-eight down there. Yeah. There we go. Host Linden is, uh, has left the coalition. Whoa. Oh. oh. It's because they just had their own little war. Like an own little internal war. <laughs> we we don't mind that happening. That's definitely something we wouldn't uh, wouldn't have any issues with. Come on. Moreland might also leave the coalition because they're in a bit of a civil war now too. So we might luck out. <laughs> and they're at 178. Fuck, I'll have another stability point. What the hell's going on here? I'm just randomly losing stability points. No, I want... No, I want the fleet. No, the fleet. No, the fleet. There we go. Yeah, you can go to the twins. Let's repair it. There. Uh, yeah, okay. One of the generals is dead, no big deal. Pause. Uh, Sanford's left the military coalition. Morland's left the military coalition. Bailey's left the military coalition. And Yorwick's left the military coalition. Fuck. We almost didn't even have to attack it, actually. Nah, it's still at 33. Who's the rebel? Swift and Crane. Oh. If I broke... What if I did this? These guys, this old military alliance. They're already at 172, right there. Perfect. 50, 50, that's 100. Plus, perfect. Sounds good. Crane's not left it perfect. Oh, what's this? Uh, bigger brother in Lesport desires a home. If we house him in the capital, we lose 25 administrative points, but local unrest goes down. 
If we have a Zeminolok village, local, we only lose 10 administrative points, but, low, but it still goes down by 1. And if we don't, okay, we're going to put it in the capital. So we got a lower unrest, anyways. Whoa! I don't know what just happened there. But these guys just got smacked. We're actually at our force limit, which is a good thing. One seventy nine, one eighty two. Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. We're almost at the range of oh, more people have left the military coalition. Perfect. Really? Nope. You just uh, let's see here. Guess six hundred sixteen. Border friction minus four. Oh, okay. Let's. Move you down here. Four for some minus two. Okay, we're gonna move you up here too. See if that fixes that. We're at uh, one eighty five and one eighty. What other things can I do to? I'm not too worried about that. These are just aggressive expansion. I'll just let them grind out that last little bit then. Hmm. Let's see here. Once we vassalize these two, we can slowly work our way around. Who else will be? Who else wouldn't mind getting vassalized by us? Oh, there we go. Plum wouldn't mind it at all. One eighty-eight, one eighty-one. Come on, come on! We're so close. We're so close. Kenning, come on. One eighty-eight. What's going up by every month? Doesn't say how much is going up by every month. Kind of cool if it did that. Like it would be so much better if it told you how much it's going up by, by, by every month. Privileges a hundred. Transfer trade power two is ten per, is plus ten. Oh, uh, d d d our leaders died. We have formed a personal union with Marbend. The old king of House Marbin whittled at his throne should be passed to House Lannister. What? How did I suddenly get into this war with Piper? The Marburn Succession War. Piper and Drox against... Um, okay. Well... Since they declared war on me... I just need you and you to give me access. So, oh no. Actually, let's do this. Relations. Stop. Stop. Okay. 
influence real quick. No, nope. influence. Target customer must be a piece. Oh, we're at war right now. Okay. So you access military rights. You ask for military rights. Good news, so a lot of troops. Boom. What, didn't you give me military rights? Yeah, you both gave me military rights. Did you not? Wait, what, hell, what the hell happened here? I asked you for military rights, you said yes. Okay, well, I'll just go for that first. Or cut into. You've entered a military coalition against me, even though I'm the one that got attacked. Okay. Let's see how that is. I'm gonna wipe these guys out. Pick a leader for you. Good leader for you. Move my entire force into Drox. You know they're in foreign country. So once we take that, we're going right in. We're going to annex anything, though. We're just going to fight them. Because they're the ones attacking me. One giant assaulting army. And then we're going to move in and we're going to take House Piper, who were our allies for like <laughs> the longest time, who've now decided to stab us in the back. And Bentley, who we asked for all the, for, to, for access, uh, turned around, gave us the access. And then turned around and created a coalition against us, who then, or joined the coalition that Crackle's in. Crackle? Craig Hall. Eh, whatever. So we're gonna roll into Piper and just lay waste. So I can't see them having too much of a large force. 
Most force them to give us all their money and transfer all their trade power. Boom. Well, we're going right for the capital, actually, right at the beginning. We lost. Wow, that's a first. Well, hold on, let's try right now. What's there? Three, four, five. Oh, they are higher military error. So we have the we have the numbers, but they have the technology. there was a way for me to tell Fuck, they are just taking us to fucking... They are just taking us to fucking town. Three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go regular Worcester soldier, heavy cavalry, and regular trebuchets. I'm going to leave that for a minute. So now they won't have the advantage of technology, though I'm going to be losing massive amounts of money right now. Let these guys recoup. I'm gonna move them down here. Actually, you know what? No. We're gonna use them to tack in. Let's 
see what happens. Yeah. Bam. Let's chase him. Chase him down, chase him down. We went from we're going to lose this for to I'm going to spend all my money. <laughs> Drop a siege, we're gonna go there. We're gonna drop a siege and we're gonna go up there. We're going to teach people not to attack us. Basically where we buy our entire military. <laughs> Holy crap, for a second there I thought we were gonna lose this war. Talk about timing. Um, so we can't do anything. You're still... You're 192. You're 195. Let's... Prove you. And let's improve you. And then once we have... Things built up, we will... Add, get Piper to give us tons of money and trade power and all that stuff. Let's up the speed a little bit here because we know we've got it. It's just a matter of waiting now. Oh. Uh, warrior demands for, uh, representation. Is expected to the seven of them to be in a trial combat set of just, yeah. Uh, gain 25, uh, get 10, 10 faith and uh, 25 diplo. 5 faith, 25, ooh. We need the military power, but we we'll lose five faith. Eh, whatever. <laughs> uh, let's perfect. Pause real quick. Where was that? That was there. We're gonna go. Put those guys there. What we might try to tell them to do is maybe release somebody, because they've they must have taken somebody. Recall. No. Oh. One of the seven. Well, t preferably the prestige or the manpower. Perf Lost stability. God damn it. Come on, Piper. Yep. We'll keep rolling up the country. Yeah, Piper now wants peace, right? You declare war on me, and now you think you can dictate peace terms to me. Ain't gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. I'm gonna keep moving troops up. One more victory, and we have a 100% war score. We'll bring all the troops back, and then we'll negotiate. So the boat thing I found is because of the rivers. So we're going to let our troops come home first, and then we'll negotiate. So we'll wait. Come on. Come on. Then we're 
also going to do is take all our uh, mercenaries and dump them. Hey, can ten prestige. No piper. No. So we're going to take all of them. Thank you for your service. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we're gonna take we're gonna piece you out here. Now, technically, I can take all those provinces. Or I can do a full annexation. If I fully annex you... <laughs> I won't be able to do much. Yep, yeah, we're gonna annex you. Because I need the land, and the plan is to then push, and I'm doing this with my hands, is to push maybe in this way and this way and connect the two countries. Um, there's just these two in the way. So we'll have to decide what we're going to do here. Do we annex? It means we can't take Drox. We don't want Drox anyways. I think they become... Yeah, you went. Fuck it. Let's annex them. Can make a run if you are... I'm currently at war with his Vance now. Oh my god, seriously. Who are these people? Uh, yeah, I know my overextension is dangerously high. Because apparently I'm at war with yet another fucking country. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, so the entire army comes back. Oh, they're my vassal. Perfect. Okay. So I would like access rights, please. Really, do I have to ask them for... Fuck's sake, seriously? I have to ask my own... They're not a vassal. Mental note. They're not at war. They're not at war. They're not at war. Perfect. Move you to Drox. <sighs> Here we go again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. I'm so fucking broke. <sighs> 